Yeah, so we recently published uh, uh, the updated results from Keynote 13, which, uh, as you know, is the initial phase 1B experience of pembrolizumab, uh, which looked at both Hodgkin's lymphoma, published now several years ago, as well as various subtypes of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. What we learned and wanted to publish was firstly to highlight the longer term follow up of patients with primary mediastinal lymphoma, again, showing the excellent results there in terms of single agent activity and longer term PFS, but also to look a little bit at more interesting combinations that might have included uh, lenalidomide with pembrolizumab, where this has not been well studied in lymphoma, maybe some interesting signal there. But unfortunately, the story with uh, pembrolizumab and other checkpoint inhibitors in general in typical subtypes types of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, like standard DLBCL or follicular lymphoma, is that the single agent activity is modest, and so we'll still need to look at other approaches to try and build on that from an immunotherapy perspective.